What is up? What is up, everybody? So we have something great today. I finally was able to get my hands on one in stock instead of trying to order it online and wait 10 plus days for shipping or whatever it is. I was trying to find one in store. <clears throat> and man, can I just say, it is hard to find one in stock right now. But we got one, so... I'm going to crack right into the new Scarlet and Violet Elite Trainer Box. Now, if you guys have watched other videos on my channel, we already know what an Elite Trainer Box is. This one is a little bit different because it is a Scarlet and Violet series. So apparently, there are two different types of promo cards you can pull from this. Uh, so here we are with the nice, neat little pamphlet thing it gives us. And uh, also, again, with the cool, fancy art style up in the inside. Hold on, let me let me uh, take it up, separate it real fast for you guys to see. Uh, where is it? Maybe. This one's not folded together like the other ones have been. Oh no, they just hid the they hid the crease a lot better this time. It's not just like in the middle of the box. It's actually on a corner. But. Booyah, hold on, get that out of the way. Booyah, look at that. Good looking art style, like it. Got the cool art on the inside of the box. And then we have the box itself. So let's go ahead, get the top up and out of here. I know you guys are excited because I'm excited for this. We got the really cool uh, placelet holder. We can get that up and out of the way as well. Let's go ahead, start by taking a look at the dice. Some good looking dice. I can add that to my collection, which is uh, always fun. Got some more coins to flip, which is always, always needing more coins, can never go wrong. Got the gold on the inside of the sleeves with, ooh, the Coridon there in the bat on the back of the sleeves with the red. Like it a lot, like it a lot. And let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and we got, so it looks like just one card and that is the Coridon. Nice, beautiful. Love that style. He looks really pretty. Gotta like it. And then uh, we have obviously our energy pack and then our separators, which, ooh, gotta love that coloration. Gotta love that colors. And then, uh, Cool, cool, cool looking backside. Okay, so let's go ahead and we have nine packs of the new Scarlet and Violet series. So let's go ahead and crack right into these. This is gonna be so much fun to do for you guys. I did open a couple just singular packs of the new Scarlet and Violet just to get a taste of what they look like and so then I would know how to properly open them because I'm not gonna lie, uh, the fur I, I bought three of them. The first one I messed up because I thought it was the old card trick, like you know where you take the four and then you put it to the back and then yada yada, whatever. You know what I'm saying? No, it's not. It's nothing like that at all. It is uh, actually it is this right. So take your code card, put it to the side, take the one from the pack in the back, put it to the front. That's it. So let's get into it with our first pack. We're starting off with a basic energy of the psychic type, a tandem mouse, a smoliv, a primate, a palmy, a picnic basket, a bombarder, hypno. Ooh, our first reverse is a flaming or er, flamigo, flamigo into a youngster, and ooh, we got the king gambit. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, okay, let's go ahead and jump into it. King Gambit, that's a, uh, in my Violet playthrough, he is, uh, de he definitely carried me a little bit for a little while while I was, uh, trying to get, uh, I caught one in the wild, and when I was trying to get, uh, you know, get my starter leveled up, he definitely carried me for a little bit it wasn't a king gambit but it eventually evolved into a king gambit i caught the bisharp in the wild but we're gonna get the fire type energy this time with the switch 
Foy Coco, gotta love Foy Coco. Atropius, Pokeball, Arvin, Cactern, cool. A Drifblim. Ooh, we got a Flabebe. Oh, let's go! Got a. Oh my gosh, got an all. Like the illustration art rare. Let's go. Great Tusk EX. And there's one more behind here. And we got another one, Oiklid EX. Oh my gosh. Oh, double big pull. Let's go ahead get these sleeves cracked open because we officially have a pulls big enough to put them in sleeves. Heck yeah. This is why I wanted to do a Scarlet and Violet series with you guys because I just had a feeling that, uh, like, I, I knew there was a lot of high chances for big stuff, and you guys like seeing the big pulls, so, you know, it kind of goes hand in hand, you know? Like, if you guys like seeing all the cool fancy cards and all that stuff and Scarlet and Violet series are supposed to have some of the best pull rates of all the fancy cards and stuff so like you know what we got the ETB of it so let's get into pack number three here like what a crazy pull with only pack number two like in some of my other ETB packs we had to wait until like pack four or five to get our first pull you know what I mean like that's actually kind of crazy. And we actually pulled those with a white code card, too. So I'm pretty positive the code cards mean absolutely, like the code card borders mean absolutely nothing in this. Or white means they're really good. Because I have no clue because I, I've only pulled white ones so far. And I've pulled these two from, again, white code card. So I have no clue. But we got the water type energy, the Torantula the Rylu, the Magneton, the Klotzer, the Beach Court, and then a Sandaconda. Nice. Hold on. I'm sorry. I'm just uh, straightening up the uh, extra pile over here, or the bulk pile. Caddy. Ooh, we got a Satitan. Cool. That's actually sweet. Oh, a Wiglet. Let's go. Another crazy art style. Look at that Wiglet. He is cool, he is cool. Oh, and we got a Magnazone EX behind it as well. Look at that. Oh my gosh, crazy pull, crazy pull. More sleeves coming right up. Because he's a two-star rider. And, uh, well, I'm going to try and get him into place. There we go. There's our Magnazone. And then our Wiglet, and he is a golden star. So, man, do we already have some crazy new poles. Crazy poles. Hoo-wee. Let's keep going. We still have one, two, three, four, five, six. We still have six packs left. That was only pack three, and we already have all those crazy poles. So, I mean, only thing I can say is that let's keep this up. These are some crazy poles. Three packs in. Get that up and out of here. Booyah. All right. Ooh, got the grass type energy with the Rodham behind it. Gotta like the Rodham. Pal Pad. The Flabebe again. Toxel. Mesagoza. Defiance being. The Tatsugiri. Ooh, our reverse is Palmo. Look at that. That's cool. Oh, mouse hold reverse. And, ooh, we got the Coridian, just the normal one. Look at that. You know what? Because it's a legendary and because it's Coridian, we're going to throw it right up in here. Booyah. Throw her up in a sleeve, and we can put them right up next to the other Coridian. Right over there. What a pull. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get right up into the next one. Ooh, knifey. It looks like I'm going to need to sharpen you soon. He has been helping us out with a lot of packs recently. Because, uh, you know, as you can tell, you know, hand doesn't, it doesn't open packs that well when you have a broken thumb. <laughs> but let's go ahead and flip this over. We got that steel type energy this time. Ooh, graveyard. 
a Mastiff, a Ponyard, a Wiglet. We already got that uh, alternate art Wiglet or the illustration art Wiglet. The Star Raptor, uh, Electric Generator. My bad. Wug Trio. Ooh, Team Star Grunt with the ho Reverse Hollow, a Squovet Reverse Hollow, and a Skeledridge Hollow. Nice, nice, nice. So the only reason why I'm putting the Skeledridge over there is because I already pulled, I already pulled one of them before, and like good pull, great pull, love Skeledridge. Uh, but the card is not that expensive. I was hoping the starters would be worth a, li a little bit something because, you know, starters, like, every single time the starters are worth a decent amount. But Skeledridge did not, he did not suffice. So, we got that electric type energy this time with the Ralts right behind that. Got the Growlithe, the Shuppet, Tandem Mouse, Nest Ball, Pachirisu. Picnic basket. Ooh, like the slow poke reverse. Ooh, the go go reverse. And ooh, another Karidon. Look at that. That's actually pretty crazy. Got another one. We could put him right there in front of the other one. <laughs> That's funny. Got three Karidons now. And let's go ahead, crack right into this one as well. Maybe if it wants to open. There we go. Booyah. And we got that grass type energy with the Toad School, the Sand Dial, the Hound Doom. The Fido, Judge, Floatzel, Team Star Grunt. This should be our first reverse, which is Squawkabilly. Into the Tarantula or Tarantula, and Professor's Research. Nice, nice. And then we are on to our last two packs here. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. If you're still here sticking through, thank you so much for watching. Go ahead, smack that like button while you're already here. Because, I mean, why not? It helps the channel grow. And it helps me keep going out and grabbing more cards and more packs and things for you guys. And I'm kind of interested. i seen an entire bundle, which is a 36 booster pack. So it would be 36 individual one of these. From Scarlet and Violet, and I could get them for the same of an entire Elite Trainer box. So, would you guys rather just see a video of me doing like 36 Scarlet and Violet packs over me doing an Elite Trainer box, and then like maybe I'll speed it up and voice over it or something? Leave a comment down below if that's kind of what you're into, or if that's what uh, you'd rather see on this over an Elite Trainer box, or I'll just keep doing both, maybe. But we got the basic energy fighting type, a Smoliv, Primate, a Palmy, Torantula, Bombearder, a Hypno, Beach Court, the Hedacross, or Hedacross, the Crocodile, and, ooh, Arb Arboliv, or Arbolivia, Arbolivia, maybe? Not exactly positive. But on to the last pack now. Come on, we need some last pack magic. We got some good pulls to the first couple. And then these last couple have kind of died out a little bit. So let's go ahead and hook us up with some last pack magic. Why don't we? And drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Got that fire type. Got that scatter bug. Got that drift loon. Ooh, Sprigatito. Gotta love it. For little. Lucario, Rock Chest Plate, a Satitan again. Ooh, Corellia is our reverse. Lechonk is the other one. And, oh, it's. Oh, Revavroom, let's go. He carried me for a little bit too. But, uh, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. These were some crazy pulls up here. 
And like I said, if you guys would rather see me just do 36 actual booster packs of Scarlet and Violet instead, because that's a lot more cards per video rather than doing like a good portion of the video on like the extra stuff like the dice and stuff like that, I could just go ahead and get right into doing packs. So if you guys would rather see that, let me know in the comments down below. And thank you so much for watching. Go ahead, smack that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next time. Peace.